what up? All right, really cool one today. This marks a big part of the season. I got a Matt's Peppers box, a, I don't know if it's medium or large. It's just a, a ton of peppers, so many. But there's one of the biggies is one he's been working on. This is the F4, which means fourth generation pepper cross. So this one is uh, Count Dracula and his Mattapeno. The Count Matcula. And it is a stellar orange red combination. If I can keep my ham grabbers out of the way. Oh my lord, look at that kirkin. Oh. And yes, it is the jalapeno -y style. And Count Dracula. Count Dracula also looks like this. But it is that lovely black to red with a ton of corking. So I am extremely excited about this one. Again, I said F4, fourth generation. It has kind of stabilized. So we don't know what else it will do. But handy chopper. Chop. And then you can best bet these are going in my seed collection. There's already one in this Boy is juicy. Oh my lord. I also, you heard that crunch. I know you heard that crunch. And this time I'm labeling my seed collection. Collecting. Oh, I've been so bad about it. Oh. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh. It's an aromatic jalapeno style. And as you can see, it's full of the juice and the seeds. Yeah, that box, the box I got from him is Stone Cold Stacked. I got some stuff I've only heard about, and then some stuff I didn't even know about. So, that means y'all get some more peppers. And talking. Alright, so, there are so many seeds in this one. I like it. Nice, clean, white. We're just going to save them. Mmm, mmm, there's so many seeds. We're gonna try and get them all out of this one so I can eat and collect seeds out of the other side. You suck. Oh, come on. Come on now. Yeah, you're watching me struggle, guys. I understand. It's not what you wanted, but it's what you get. Let's just put that half to the side. Oh, I was dealing with peppers. Kind of all this week. I got my Pique Criollo uh, red habanero and pineapple sauce all jarred up. It's sitting there with the vinegar, letting them all marry and get along. Boy, did it taste fine whenever I was putting it all together. I could not keep my, I couldn't keep it off my hands for one. But then also, that means I get the sample. And boy, is that batch big. I made a lot ski. A lot more than I thought I was going to. Almost filled up a 20 quart pot with it. Okay, there we go. Sort of, I'm almost there. This one smells a little bit floral right off the bat, so we're gonna see. But I am liking what I got so far. Okay, so also. Mm -hmm. All right, so again, this is how lovely and absolutely fantastic that is. Mm. And also, I love the thick walls on that. Like, I just, I love a thick wall pepper because of the crunchy. Captain Crunch. Okay, so here we go. Macula, the Count Macula. It's a Count Dracula crossed with, no, I'm sorry, other way around. Matapeno crossed with a Count Dracula. Somebody will correct me in the comments. It's fine. Go there to get your real information, but I'm excited. Here we go. Oh. Sweet, watery, very juicy. There's some heat. It's just like chewing good fruit. It's a very light sweetness. Boy, that heat is negligible. Oh yeah, that. Oh yeah. If you're lucky to get one of these right now, you're going to like it. Mm. 
That is a mild heat. Now I would say that's this one, the one that I'm having, it's probably on par with like a really stinging poblano. Not as sweet as a ripe poblano or like a bell pepper or anything like that, but it is, it's good. The flavor is perfect. There's no floral. Um, the scent is kind of different from the taste in that like it smells a little bit floral on the nose, but no, we're, Mm. Oh. Right, he goes out of the side. I don't want that stem. Mm. It's a nice, just mild, warm, snackable pepper. That's something I would do with it. You know what? This would be a good salad pepper. Which a really good balance in between them. And I think then I could be very wrong. I won't know till the site comes up. It'll be in the fall. But I do believe he might have some seeds up for this. Get them while you can if he does. I'm telling you right now, this is definitely going to be something I grow out later because that was absolutely fantastic. And usually I believe the foliage looks just phenomenal. It's the, the quality that Matt's known for. Um, mm. And as a bonus, I don't know what this is. It came in unlabeled. Somebody in the comments will tell us, but look at that Ooh, peachy deliciousness. Put it in front of my face so you have something you really want to look at. There we go, there we go, yes. All right, I'm just gonna eat it. I don't know what it is. This might be a super hot, I genuinely don't know. Sweet right off the bat. That's right. Quite a bit of shade, actually. No bitterness. Less heat than that mat than that uh, Count Macula was, but there is still a little bit of heat there. Try right. cheese. The seeds give me a little bit of bitterness at the end. That is not in the pepper. It is in the seeds. That pepper was incredibly sweet. I'll figure out what that is. I'll probably update in the comments at some point. But, boy, we're back. We're back with hot boxing, baby. Those were special editions. This is a hyper boxing. Mmm. But anyway, I'll see y'all later.